I started with the Navy in 1984, Navy Reserves. That's these two here. I have anger problems. Uh, I suffer from OCD, PTSD. When I was in the service, I went through a major state of depression where I tried to commit suicide. I would close my eyes and see my own death. And it looked so beautiful, you know? Since I've been dealing with, with Keith all the way to now, things have changed. Keith helped me turn my life around. He opened that door, which I never thought that I could find that door. I'm in a happier place. I'm back where I belong. My wife, Iris, my heart. What's my story? Well, um, when I was 18, I wanted to go to business school and I took out a $2,000 loan. A week later, I go back to school. The school was closed down. 20 years later, I get this um, letter saying I owe $30,000 to the Department of Education. I'm in a shelter now because of, you know, of this. Everybody's looking at me like I'm, I was some kind of criminal. And I found out there was 60,000 other people like me. And now I don't owe anything, so I'm free. I feel like a bird right now, I'm like free. I, I get goosebumps just thinking about it. Ellos van perdiendo poco a poco la memoria. Para mí era muy triste de ver a mi esposa así, un hombre tan activo. Triste, muy triste. Yo tocaba puertas y no, no podía obtener ayuda. Gracias a Dios. Y a, Nay, a Naila y a Peter, pues puedo tener un poco más de tranquilidad y puedo respirar un poco más. I had a foreclosure problem. Without sending any paperwork notification of anything, the property tax went up and the mortgage jumped by uh, almost $300. The balance balloon up. Talking to those financial institution on your own without an attorney is useless. The doorbell rings sometime I'm saying, oh my God, I hope it's not the marshals putting a note on the door. Will my neighbors see the, you know, the marshal evicting me, changing the locks? It, could, it would have been probably a disaster for me and the family. Calls, papers, um, meetings, court appearance, and she worked tirelessly to help us. My home is my home again. I'm making my payments, I'm working. The doctor told me I'm gaining weight, so I gotta hit the gym now because I'm happy now. Life gives you ups and downs, but life is good. I love life. I love it. I adore my daughter. I feel like she was a, that push to make me grow up. I wanna be I want to be the example for my daughter. So when I got married, I was 20 years old, and I got my daughter when I was 21. Screaming at me, telling me how I wasn't able to be a wife, I wasn't able to be a mother. He was going to take my daughter away from me and just leave me in the streets. I like it's part of my family. They they help me with with everything. To believe, to dream, to trust myself again. There are people that care. 
If it wasn't for Nylak, I don't know what I would be doing right now. Thank God, thanks for Nylak, and I hope they could do this for someone else, to, like myself, to change their life around. <laughs>